Mallor Park. This was never a place that we even knew of until we started our travels and people said, you've got to go see this place. And we thought, why not? So on our way to Cairns, we called in there and had a look. Wow, what can I say? It, um, it's all about this one guy with a dream way back when, way before his time. You really need to go and listen to the guys. They can tell this story so well. The people there are so passionate about it. This grand staircase we are walking down is all made by hand. The whole park, all the buildings, everything's all made by hand, made his own concrete. Um, yeah, you, you, you won't fathom it until you actually go there. The wildlife, like the abundance of fish, turtles, water. They say there's crocodiles, you don't see any, but you can never be too sure up this way. These whole buildings, all made by hand, unbelievable. Yes, this was a tennis court area and people would just come in. It was a whole area there that we were told was a kitchen area for dining. There was change rooms, uh, unbelievable. This guy was way, way ahead of his time. Look at that water pressure. Gardens were so beautiful to walk through. You could spend hours walking through there. It was $50 entry fee. And, and you can stay there at camping as well. They give you a night's camping and you can do a night tour, which we've done that as well. Unbelievable. All these trees, everything was all designed by this guy. That was a, a tunnel which he tried to make aquarium out of. This is all walking through the park. This waterfall, beautiful. And up the top there, he even made his very own hydro system. The first person to ever be able to do it in Queensland or up north, especially in those times, he had uh, power in the middle of the bush. They would even have frozen ice creams, like, and a big ballroom, movie theater. This place is unbelievable. You must go and have a look for yourselves.